Had to keep working on me Till I got it right, right, right This whole keep looking at me Now I got it right, right, right What's going on guys? Welcome back to the challenge Your host with the most Tomboy00 And you're currently watching Tomboy TV And today we are out here for the spring summer 2020 lookbook It's currently 8 a.m. The lookbook came out at I think 6.30 a.m. Your boy had to sleep a little bit later, you know. I went to bed like at two in the morning, so you know we we had to we had to chill chill it out. I'm not that much into this anymore, you know. So why you always lying? No, I'm I'm still loving them, Brandon. Don't get me wrong. And I heard, I heard, I heard. I looked in the Discord real quick. I saw one image of the Motion logo hooded sweatshirt, and that automatically has it. In, like that's a must cop for me. Uh, I heard it's really really good season. I still once again have not looked at any any pieces individually or anything like that I saw my notifications going off. They're still going off and I still don't even look at them But signups are now open for the new balance shoes and yeah So I didn't look at anything just I saw the motion logo because I did have to check the discord real quick The premium discord that did restock yesterday slots may be coming soon later But you know if you slept you slept it is what it is so we also have a giveaway coming up soon for the strange love SBs potentially but Anyways, we're about to run into this. We're going to get my reaction. Where we're doing it, we have the computer right over here. You know, also, by the way, you can get yourself some Tommy Boy TV sticker packs at TommyBoyTV.com. You can get a pack of 10 stickers for just $5 plus a dollar shipping, so $6. Come on. Beautiful. I make literally a dollar off it. So I'm sorry, but like I had to make something, you know, but the stickers are expensive. So if you guys want to cop support, I appreciate it so much. Uh, check it out at TomboyTV.com. So anyways, I'm about to put you guys up on the screen. I'm excited. Yo, I'm excited because this, this is like another two and a half months of my life, you know, because if you guys don't know, Supreme is what I use. I, like, I, like, I, I do still make a lot of content about because I know a lot of people like, and I still do appreciate it, but it's just different from what it used to be, of course, and as everyone tells you, but I do really appreciate like a lot of the cool aspects like this hooded sweatshirt I love because it originates, I'm not no OG either, but like 274 Lafayette. <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful place. So the online release will be on a week from today. The in-store release will be this Thursday. Remember, it's always a few days before. Uh, so yeah, we're about to roll right into it. So this is the spring summer 2020 preview. We're gonna go to view all. Oh, I see the Air Forces. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I saw that, I saw that. You know, I saw that, maybe. Maybe I saw this before, maybe I did. So we have the splatter. This looks like some cool art piece, yo. Gore-Tex Anorak. Yo, that shit slaps. You see, I like this piece right here. I like this. It's like artistic. It looks like you took that marble from like the first grade and just put it into that cover box and just let that shit slide. I forgot what that artwork is called, but that's dope. Well, let me put the, let me zoom in a little bit so I can actually, no, let me, so I'll put myself in the bottom left corner, but yo, so we have all the jackets. All right. We saw this leak out already. We did see this leak out. The Vance, oh, this is a Vance and jacket. So that's going to be expensive already right off the bat. That's going to be an easy, easy over a thousand around. Actually, this isn't even leather. So, oh no, it is. Leather, the letters are leather, but the actual jacket isn't. So that's going to be calm. That's going to be calm, calm price. Uh, not a fan of that. The faux suede. This was also leaked out at first as well by some other page. Reflective taping. Uh, yeah, I'm not a fan of this one either. It looks like too much latex for me. Too much latex. Shiny, reversible, puffy jacket. I don't know if I'm a fan of that one. But this, yes, yes, this slaps. Yo, this is official MLB New Era collaboration for the jacket, the varsity jacket. All cotton twill fill. This slaps. And I love how they have the Yankees, the biggest logo. NLA. New York and LA because that's where Supreme is. And they have a Supreme box logo right there, yo. That piece slaps. Yo, I could see this one going for a good, good amount. And I could see a lot of professional, like just professional sports players in general wearing this. And what is this? Ooh. Montclair? Montclair? Oh, no, that's not no Montclair. <laughs> Imagine Supreme Montclair collaboration. Uh, piece and logo at, at front and back with embroidered logo on chest. Fire piece as well. Oh, you know, we got the Gucci. Dude, the jackets are looking dope, yo. This looks like a week one piece. So I feel like this would be, this would be the piece that's dropping during week one. This piece goes hard, not gonna lie. I do like this one. I do like, oh, the colorways are so nice. The baby blue, oh yes, oh yes. That that goes hard. What is this, another Vanson jacket? Mm, pass, as usual. Sometimes the Vanson jackets, yo, what the hell is this? Oh, the City Lights puffy jacket, beautiful. I like that. That's gonna be a piece too, as we kinda slept on. I could tell this piece is gonna be slept on at first because it does have Supreme Browning on it, but this kinda reminds me, that has like that all over print, like the Grand Prix Anorak. But this one's again is a jacket, yo. Puffy jacket too, a big puffy jacket. See, but it's spring summer, yo. Like well, they're dropping all these fire jackets and they could have done this before, but 
it is what it is. We got the Ripstop Utility Jacket. This is dope. I really like how they have that classic outline logo on that one piece. I think they got the grid lines coming down as well. Uh, we got the camo, the magenta, the black. And, yeah, that's just the three different colors of the grid lines. Yo, I'm really liking the way the season's looking right now. I'm not going to lie. I do like it. I do like it. What is this? This reminds me of the Yankees collab. Oh, no, it's not. It doesn't look anything like what I was thinking it was going to look like. So we do have this. We have the varsity jacket. Yo, this is the exact same thing on the OVO pants I just got. If you guys don't know, I went to the OVO warehouse sale, and they just had – I just bought pants with that on the pants. Pants were shit quality, by the way. They are absolutely horrendous quality. But, you know, we still did spend $65 on them. What a waste. But world famous Supreme Cream. Oh, team. Yo, I said cream. Yo, what the hell is wrong with me? So we're all famous Supreme Team. Yo, orange colorway. Then they, I'm assuming they have another colorway. Let's see what else they got. Orange, blue. Yeah, that's also going to be a nice little comp piece that no one really cares too much. Oh, wait, wait. I got to go right to this. Oh, yes, sir. West side. I'm kidding, yo. Chill. <laughs> That was a bad move. But anyways, look at this. We have so this is basically uh, Supreme did drop the preview of this video. They did do this video. Um, uh, it was from it's a hol it's from his hologram performance at Coachella in 2012, and I just can't wait to see the Instagram captions of all those humans go to Coachella and wearing this T-shirt there because it's it's gonna be bad. But anyways, I skipped. I apologize. I did skip through a whole lot of other pieces. Not what I was looking for. I did skip through a whole lot of pieces. I apologize just because I had to see what that Tupac T was about. Oh, my voice cracked. Oh, that was bad. Sorry, it's mad early in the morning, ladies and gentlemen. So we got that piece right there, a flannel. Oh, we got it all over print. Rayon. Trippy. This is some acid trip. I always wonder how they come up with these ideas. You know, I always wonder how they come up with this design in particular. Like, they're like, drop the tad. They're like, yo, go at it, boss. And I was like, I guess they just went at it. They really did go at it. Oh, oh, you know who that is? That's that dictator, bro. Or am I tripping? Cherion. I think that's a dictator from Cuba, if I'm not mistaken. I might be wrong. I don't got my pol pol politics and economics all on point. Oh, but this is the same design that's matching the puffy jacket. Oh, uh, what is this? What is this? A cartoon sweater. Yo, that's that guy. Dude, I have to get my I have to get back on my culture. I don't know why this computer is glitching like that. But, like, the cartoon sweaters are right there. I do like that. You know, they don't really do many cartoons. Like, Car Supreme doesn't reference a lot, a lot of cartoons out there. They do reference a few TV shows. Ooh, the spread logo. This reminds me of that hooded sweatshirt they dropped last season as well. All right, that's tough. It's a knit. It looks like it's a all. It's like a knitted sweater though, which I don't like either because the way it fits on you, it kind of like drapes over you because it's like a heavier, heavier material, so it kind of just drapes over your body. But it's dope if you have like a button shirt under, like a collared shirt, you know, looking nice and professional. We got a New York sweater out here as well. All right, that looking calm. That's looking calm. This is what is this a cardigan? It is a card. It's a it's a polka dot cardigan. Ooh. Nice. I, I see they're diving into the female sector. Well, we got a jersey out here already. This reminds me of Chinatown, to be honest with you. Chinese New Year does remind me that, but art by Keegan Dacker. Honestly, never heard of him, but I also haven't heard a lot of other people that Supreme has collaborated with. And I end up really, really enjoying their work. Now, let's see. They got more button shirts all over prints. Oh, this is dope. Supreme. Oh, yes. Racing soccer jersey. See, if it, if it was a button-up right here, if this was like a button-up rayon shirt, I feel like that shit would have been way, way better. But unfortunately, it's not, yo. That's dope. I still I like that. I like that because it's motocross. It reminds me of like the Grand Prix. Is this another biking jersey? Oh, they're doing it again? Oh, uh, why? 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 I mean, of course, they got Brandon coming off crazy. Last time, it was like really, really hyped at first. And then a lot of people end up just like not really caring for the collaboration too much. Because I think it also dropped during a really, really, really weird week when it did drop last season. It's custom, relaxed fit, breathable poly, full zip closure with rear pockets, supreme branding all over. You can see box on the front and side, but it looks like they're inside of an RV. Or like they look like they're inside of an RV. I don't know if I'm tripping or if that's just me, but that's if I don't want to spend too much time on each piece because once again, there's a lot of pieces to get through. I think at least this is the baseball jersey, easy pass, nice little bricko. Uh, but and once again, if I call something a brick, it doesn't mean I don't like it. it. Just means I can tell it's not gonna have a lot of resale value. That's the only reason why I call it a brick. I know a lot of people out there who watch me are into the, for the resale glitter football jersey. I don't like the I don't really like the jersey the the athletic stuff they be doing. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I really don't like it. And what is this? This is a long sleeve top. That's dope. It looks really cool, my but the sleeves look stupid short on this one compared to how the body is right here. It looks very, very short. What is this? 
Oh, rainbow. Is this like a felt material? Oh, Chanel applique logo. That's going to be like an easy $78 retail piece right there. We have the all over Supreme t-shirt. This was also leaked out but originally. Uh, then we also have Easy E. Yo, Easy E in the house. I should stop, right? They're referencing so many rappers. Oh, we got the good stuff. We want it to be known as Supreme. This is the cotton fleece. Oh, multiple different colors. We got a yellow, black, right, orange, red, and turquoise. Now, this references that iconic font that be, they be using. It kind of almost looks like the... Uh, I know they're going to... I'm pretty sure they have a towel with this as well. But I know for a fact that this is like the same... The font that they'd be using before, like for Legal Business Controls America. It's similar, not exact, but similar. This also leaked out by, uh, what's that skater's name, bro? Not Paolo, not them. Uh, dude, that really young skater for Supreme. I'm sorry, I'm, I don't know, I forgot his name, but that really young dude. And then we got Top of the World, Kath Kathmandu. Embroidered logo. Of course, I'm a sucker for the embroidery. I love the embroidery. So now we're diving into the more of the hooded. I should have probably went by categories over here, but you know, I decided to just go for all it at once. Supreme 2008 Star Crew Neck 1994. That's when they started. 2008, 98. I think they go by every four years. I think that's when. Oh no, they don't. Yes, but why is there 2017 here? And then 2020, they skipped a few years, if I'm not mistaken. So they got oh, multiple different colors. That's dope. It reminds me of that like that. That white girl. I'm not gonna place a label on it, but like that. That long sleeve that has like Cape May, New Jersey, and has that big ass spread logo on the back as well. Uh, just some shit I see way too much up here on the northeast. Yeah, that's where I'm located. Ooh, Mona Lisa? Yo, she pranked Mary. It's Mary. They've been referencing a lot of religion lately, though, in the past few seasons. Yo, what was that? Yo, all over print hooded sweatshirts. You know this one's going to go for that. This also looks like a week one piece. Because they do like a lot of, they always have like a really, really dope all over print hoodie, a big jacket. They always have like big. <clears throat> I also have a big a piece from each category. Like, that's what I do be seeing a lot. And, of course, a lot of skate techs are going to be dropping. I don't know what skate techs are yet. Ooh, a duck camo? Ooh, that looks like velour. Or not velour. Man, that looks like uh, that fuzzy material. That doesn't look like that. Let's see what else we got. We got Ben. Oh, that's hard, yo. They did the dollar bill tee, though. If you guys don't remember, that was like that was like one of the, my favorite tees that dropped like back... Not back in the day, because it was like only like two years ago. That was like a really fire tee. This is a dope ass piece, yo. Hundred dollar bill, but what is it? Does it say Supreme anywhere? It doesn't look like. Oh no, it does. Supreme box will go right there underneath the one hundred bill, underneath the one hundred. Respect, big ups. We got multiple different colors as well. I could see, but once again, I feel like this is just not gonna be a good because the people don't like. I I would love. I would could, back in the day, like two or three years ago, this piece would have been going for the high, right? Now, different story. It doesn't go for the high like that. Then we got pants. We got this Supreme. Ooh, this is going to go for the stupid high, though. This. Oh, they got a pink colorway, too. It's a wrap, ladies and gentlemen. It's a wrap on this piece right here. This one's going to go for the high as well. Ooh, we got the pants. This also did leak out, if I'm not mistaken. This is dope, though. The Japanese fish, yo. Ooh, the koi. I'm not going to place a label on that either. I shouldn't. But that Japanese koi fish. Oof. This one goes hard. Like I don't really rock a lot of all over print just because it's too loud for me on the pants. But like this color would be dope. Uh, I do have to start changing up my wardrobe just a bit. But I want to see what other colorways they do have. They have. Eh, I don't want to see that shit. Where is it? Right here. Right here. Right here. Oh, it matches a jacket though as well. This is dope. This reminds me of the same time they did. Oh, uh, they referenced. I know back in the lookbook, the preview at least, when um, oh uh, they did end up doing the full Chinese dragon fit with the black and red embroidery. I mean the red embroidery on the black. Now, pants I don't really get into too much because of the fact they always... Ooh, cargos. You can't ever... I mean, this is nylon, though. The shinch pants. Oh, God. Oh, shinch. I call it shinch. Cinch. Cinch pants. We got those. The all-over cut-out letters. Dope. Matching the ja matching the hooded sweatshirt. This is matching the hooded sweatshirt, and it goes off the same design as the jacket. Color-blocked uh, sweatpants. This is almost the same once they dropped uh, exactly a year ago. The color-blocking crew neck and the sweatpants. Or not a season ago, I should say. This also did leak out. This one did leak out. Uh, not really leak out, but skaters were seen. When I mean leak out, it was when skaters were seen rocking it uh, throughout. S logo sweatpants. We also did see this before. Uh, nothing too special in the pants. So we got overalls, overalls, pants, 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 regular jeans as always. Pants lacking. Pants is a lacking category as per usual for them. 
Shorts though. Oh, is this another dollar bill? Oh, oh, oh. I feel like we're time traveling with Supreme. Yeah, we're going back in the 1990s with the all over print dollar bills, yo. At least they didn't do a hood sweatshirt with all over print. I like how simple that hundred dollar bill is on that sweatshirt, but on the pants, too much. Now this matches the basketball jersey and these go hard. Suplex nylon tassel. Now the material might not be the one I'm a fan of. I totally like the thicker, a little bit thicker shorts, but branding is on point for this one like on the back and on the front is it a loud is it a loud loud piece yes but who says you can't go who says go big or go home you know oh no 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 i can't wait to see the instagram pictures with this i guarantee you It'll be me. No, I'm playing. I will not wear this. I don't have the. I don't have the ball. I don't have the self-esteem to put myself out there like this. But whoever does, I definitely respect it. I will laugh, but I respect it. <laughs> Yo, if I see anyone rocking this, like the full-fledged fit. All right, fire mesh, not nylon water shorts. Water shorts is what we need. We need water shorts because it's summertime, baby. Finally going along with the seasons. Yo, that's funny. That's mad. All right, so we got the Tupac tee right here. Now, all these tees will be dropping during week one. Almost all of them. Almost all of them. So let's just run through them. All right, so we got the $100 bill tee. This is the blink, blink tee. Same as the bling keychain. They did have the bling keychain before. This is dope, though. Uh, what I see is going for a lot of money. No, but is it like... This is the type of photo tee I want. Like, if they put Tupac... Tup Whoa. If they put Tupac's thing... Like, a regular photo tee is what I want, yo. I don't like any of this, you know... I do like this, don't get me wrong, but like it's not gonna go for that much just because the fact it's like all over. If it was just him wearing a Supreme Box logo tee, automatically at least over five hundred dollars. So actually, I don't even know because Bogo's going for around like two hundred dollars right now from last season. And that's not a good sign. But we have the print logo tee, fire. All right, tie dye material, eh, loved by the children tee, all classic Supreme T-shirt, loved by the children. I don't really like how they do. I don't think religion and politics should be mixed into it, but. Oh, Naomi T. This is dope. Mark Gonzalez. This, this almost reminds me of Louis Vuitton, but this is Mark Gonzalez's iconic uh, creatures that he does. Not creatures, but the artwork that he does paint on. This only reminds me of Louis Vuitton because the monogram print right here does look similar. Uh, Supreme. So they did also do something. They always drop lately, at least for the two past seasons. They drop. A, they dro I came out with an accent. It's mad early. I apologize. But they drop always like a long sleeve t-shirt with like all over print graphic like they did one at least uh, seasons ago no two years uh, well, one full year ago they did the same one with white and purple branding on it i remember because i did end up buying that one cherry's t-shirt fire i like finally being incorporating females into their artwork yo i like that i like that if she was wearing i think it might be a supreme ring but i can't tell by the resolution right now dope cherry supreme t-shirt supreme cat masterpiece this is dope i actually like this one it's nice almost like a cartoon Supreme masterpieces. This reminds me like some old grandma painting right here. That's funny. Oh yes, yes, yo! I did not know this was coming out. Well, obviously I didn't know, but like, yo, that slaps. That's tough. Supreme New York City, yo. Wow, that's fire, yo. I really do like. This is a piece I'm gonna have to get for sure. All right, they're referencing once again. I think they saw me wearing those OVO pants, bro. I swear they see me wearing those OVO pants. This is it. All right, so this right here, this and Tupac are my two must cops from this season, for this week one. Uh, will it be tough? Yeah, it will be very tough. Now, honestly, I'm gonna not really go into the hats because I don't like the hats. Unless they got some dad cat, dad caps, and this looks like a dad cap, but whack design. Oh, uh, let's see, Supreme. Oh, this, this is like some European sport logo. This is like European Euro Euro sport. Supreme. I can see a fire commercial coming for that one. Ooh, we got a matching caps for the, the marble print. I call it the marble print. What is the actual print called? What is it? The water. It's original artwork by Room. Once again, I never heard of that art. Art. Art human. I never heard of them. But we also have that. Ooh, that fit's going to be tough. Supreme. You don't really see Supreme all over prints on top of bucket hats like this anymore. Uh, beanies. Bags. Yo. Oh. 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 Just no fire piece, bro. Fire, fire piece right here. Supreme brand at the top. Power strip outlet at the top as well. We got a bag. Oh, I love the design, but oh, finally. All right, I thought there was going to have all camo colorways. Oh, uh, uh, I don't know how I feel about the bag with that mesh look at the front. It's like a, it looks like a sport backpack though. 3D, 3M reflector printed logos. I am about to, I think I'm about to run out of storage really, really soon on the camera. So I'm going to try to get through this, even though it's accessories, my favorite part. This is matching the Vanson uh, jacket right there. We do have that shoulder bag. Uh, we do have the other bag right here. 
Uh, ooh, waist shoulder bags. All right, so they're matching the same mesh look. I'm not a fan of that fishnet stocking look right there. Not a fan of it at all, but we do also have the matching duffelets. Yo, you're basically just paying for netting right here. Now, I know they're going to charge the high, like at 138 for this. And that high is not going to be very appropriate. But, you know, bags also don't be moving that fast anymore. Is this a purse? Dude, oh, no, it's a utility pouch. Shit, man. It's a utility pouch. What is this, though? Wow. I don't... This is cool. This looks like it takes... It looks, this looks like a little more high quality, not going to lie. This waist bag is also tough because it does have that clean brand. It reminds me of something that would drop a few years ago. I like how they're bringing... Well, where's the motion logo hooded sweatshirt? Yo, hold on. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, who called it a few years? Well, I called it about a year ago. I'm pretty sure I said something about it. But they're, this is OG hoodie. OG colorway. OG colorway. OG colorway. I don't remember seeing these colorways. The red, yes, but not yellow. Black on yellow. But one color I do have to get, I think, is going to be ash gray. White, I'll get way too. This I got scammed for a fake one, if you guys remember. A while ago, I got scammed on for this one, the white one. Uh, the one color though, I don't know. This is like the only three I'd actually wear consistently. All the other ones I would just flex on Instagram, but I expect those to go for the pretty penny as well. Oh, what is this? The classic bullet hole? Is that bullet? No, it's just eyelets. A bunch of eyelets. I'm, I feel like, I, of course, I can't go into every single piece because I would take way too much time. I just want to give you guys my subtle reaction. Oh! Oh! Only a few would know. Yo, that's crazy. Oh! Oh! I'm just, if you guys know what I'm doing, you know what I'm doing, right? Yo, that's tough. Supreme Ziploc bags right there. Supreme Oreos! Dude, I died on Instagram. You know, I died on Instagram for this. That's crazy. We got the tote bag right here. This is tough. This is going to go for a lot, a lot of bread. This is all over prints like that. Doing them going well. We got a BMX bike right here as well. Oh, this is tough. This is like a low lighter. 19. I knew it was classic. I knew it was a classic year. 1995 BMX dirt bike. I must get this. Made it in the USA. Made it in the USA. Big ups. Respects. Chainsaw. Oh, that's fire. What is this? What the hell? Oh, okay. All right. I like the Fuji films. Okay. That was also known about before. Uh, Supreme bling. But okay. This also goes along with all the t-shirts and that all that design they have for week one. We got by not. Oh, is that a record player? <gasps> oh no, this is a turntable. Ch -ch -ch yo, they should put. They should make some Supreme records for this. Yo, in my opinion, they should definitely put on some records. All right, so I think my camera's about to die. Oh, that Zippo goes hard. It's just inverted colorways, glow in the dark Zippo. That's tough. Umbrellas. Yo, Poncho vibes. Poncho vibes. Yo, that's tough. We want to be known as Supreme. Clear lock. What is that? What the hell? What the hell is this? Oh, straw mat. That straw mat's tough. You know, I, I, I gotta be at peace yoga before the drop. I gotta do some yoga on my straw mat. This is how it be. We got gloves out here as well. The screwdriver gloves. We got the all-in-one tool set. I love this, yo. It's gonna be pretty expensive though, unfortunately. It's from it's in collaboration with Leatherman, so that typically does get pretty expensive. But but this is a fire, fire looking tool. Ashtray, 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 glass ashtray too. That's fire. That grant 3.3 by 3.9. That branding is also on point for this one. Speedo goggles. Swimmers are being represented. Swimmers are being represented. Speedo. Yo, I used to swim competitively and I used to pray for a collaboration. And they finally go. We got biking helmets over here with the all over print as well. This goes along with the, uh, I could definitely, I'm seeing a fit pick with this already. With the Castilli uh, collaboration they have with the jersey. All right, accessories got me excited, yo. Accessories, ooh, the dollar dollar bill Spalding collaboration. They got a lot of, hunt, they got a lot of Benji's featured in this collection though. They do got a lot of Benji's, a lot of money, a lot of other stuff featured in this collection. Oh, uh, we got that whack piece. The woven chair. Hmm. The lawn chair. Supreme branding coming in and out. Vo woven. The Simon belt. Shout out my brother Simon, y'all. Fire. Handmade in the USA. That's also going to be very expensive and also very limited. I can tell you right off the bat because it is handmade. Swarovski crystal studded. We got Swarovski coming back in the game. We got Supreme branding here and on the actual belt. Wow, that looks expensive as shit, and that's something I cannot afford. This is also going to be a high ticket item. Supreme Lithica Ultra V BR 8x20 binoculars. Yo, season's looking cool. They got cool accessories. A cool part of accessories. We got waterproof. Oh, yes. This is exactly like that old one. This is like when they dropped the first Bic lighters. This is what exactly what it looked like, except it didn't have that all over case, of course. But keychain with one inch keyring included, lighter included. Oh, of course. I was hoping it'd be lighter included, but it's just basically a case. It's a case for the lighter. Reminds me of like the M&M, like the little M&M mini cases. 
Well, they used to sell those M&Ms. We've got Air Force. They got a Tupac skate deck? Oh! <laughs> Yo, they got a Tupac. This is... Oh! They did good on this. They did good on this. No hooded sweatshirt, but it looks like we got a T and a skate deck. This will be dropping week one. Oh, is this a skyline in it? Oh, no. Oh, that's... This is a cool design, y'all. They would have done... So I'm saying, like, if they dropped this design a few years ago, this would probably be the most expensive skate deck reselling right now. I guarantee you. They got the Lakers colors coming down. RIP Kobe Bryant. We got, of course, the Air Force ones that we've already seen a million, million times out there on Instagram. Now, this will be, I can tell you for sure, this will be a GR. So this will be, like, widely available. Won't be limited. They'll have this in stock for a while. Like, almost like the Haynes collaboration. Think of it like that. The black is honestly looking like my favorite because the red on white laces don't look right. But the white on white does look right. But then again, it's just a simple branding, you know. I'm not going to hate on this design because it is simple. It's dope that they're going to have, like, a GR release out there. But basically, don't go for this resale. If you're trying to resell, it's more of a personal... Motion logo decks, cruiser. Oh my goodness, yo! All right, yo. I came in here with a little bit of negative energy. All right, so as I was saying, ladies and gentlemen, I did come into this little bit of a negative energy. Not gonna lie, I came with negative energy, but right now I'm still stuck on this motion logo. I'm surprised they're doing that. I'm very surprised. Oh, oh, oh. yo, yo, that's tough. Oh, that's tough. I could... Dude, these skate decks are finally freaking... Fu Was that an inhaler? That's a skate tool. Just kidding. <laughs> Non-skateboard. <laughs> oh, my God! Oh, Jesus! All right, ladies and gentlemen. So, unfortunately, my camera did end up spazzing out. Not spazzing out in reality, but just running out of temperature. It was too high. But listen, yo. These are cops, 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 cops. Must cop, must cop. Uh, must cop. No, must cop. Must cop that. Honestly, I might make a must cop was later, but just know that a lot of people looking fire. And my boy actually showed me a, a fufu box logo. Where is it, bro? He sent me this image. Yo, we got a BOGO! We got a BOGO! So this season is looking better than expected in my eyes. I thought it was going to be a little bit worse, but yo, looking decent. I'm excited for it. I hope you guys are ready. We'll be having a lot of live cops and in-store footage for you guys as well. Hopefully we can acquire all the items we do aim for this season. Good luck to everyone out there going for the season. Hope you guys stay tuned. Subscribe to the channel. I appreciate it so much. Make sure you check out the free Discord as well as uh, the website. I appreciate it so much. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts on lookbooks down below. Peace.